You idiots. idiots! You're fucking idiots! Get okay, the fuck out of here! You're in a neighborhood! You're in a neighborhood! You're in a neighborhood! Look at you! You're talking to nobody! My friends, you did not even imagine how much he loves you. You may be passing by right now thinking, oh, this is a good speech. But this is not a speech. This is a, literally a testimony to show you how grateful, how merciful, how loving and caring Jesus Christ is. And because we have tasted his goodness, his love, we are here today as witnesses to show you that Amen. he is real. Praise be unto Elohim. To show you that he is not yes. only a spirit. He is all. Is everything is above all things. Our heavenly Father has given him full authority on earth and in heaven. And he will be back soon, my friends. So if you can hear his voice, please don't harden your heart. The Bible says, he says himself in the book of Revelation, here I am, I knock at the door. If you open up the door, I will come and dine with you and you with me. Amen. So will you dine with him tonight or just right now as I'm speaking? <laughs> will you come to Jesus Christ to and Jesus. have the greatest relationship of your life ever? You will never regret it, my friends. Babe, monitor the police feed. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ loves you, my friends. He loves you. He has no boundaries. He knows what your beliefs are. He knows your uncertainties. He knows everything, all your burdens, all your sufferings. He knows it all, your addictions for some of you. But you know what? As he said himself, he didn't come to, to judge you, but to save you. But there will be a time when the judgment day will come. And all of us who will have an account to give to God because this time is almost up and we need to be ready when i say we need to be ready it's not to be ready to go to work or to start a new day but it's time for us to be ready to meet with the lord of lords the king of kings the the one whose name is above all names and his name is jesus christ jesus hallelujah jesus. so my friends Please, if you can hear his voice right now, don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed. Because literally we are here today to share the love of Christ. We are here today to show you, my friends. Hey, you're in a fucking neighborhood. That there is, Look, you're not even talking to anyone. Right there. We love you, my friends. We love hey, you. Hey, don't touch that. Don't touch that. Jesus don't touch that. You're in a don't neighborhood. Touch that. Look where you're don't at. No that. one's listening to you. We have freedom of speech. Fuck you. No one's okay, listening to well, you. Okay, well, that's fine. We forgive you. God forgive you, sir. God forgive you. This is not what God forgive you. You came, sir. So you're fucking idiots. You're fucking idiots. Get the fuck out of here. You're in a neighborhood. You're in a neighborhood. Then we're in this. You're in a neighborhood. Look at you. You're talking to nobody. Look at Then All right. Where people got ears? listening to you. Okay. So, so nobody. So, go the fuck home. Get okay. out of here. All right. Off. All right. Go ahead. Continue. See, Continue the word of God. You see, this is literally love. But he thinks about yelling at a six hundred. Again, eight. my friends, just to show you that this spiritual warfare is real. Radio six. This spiritual warfare is real, my friends, and you can see it through this man. Yes, my friends. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. So that guy? Praise the Lord. Amen. Hey, God forgives you. God forgives you. God forgives you. So you see, my friends, this is literally a testimony how people may hurt inside. They may be hurting inside. And you see that this man is literally stressed out because we are literally sharing the love of God and it makes he makes him really mad. Huh? Why is yeah, that? He is. He is. Because there are, there are things happening Amen. in the spiritual what, realm. What we do. There are things we begin that this all around Jersey City. Look at our will videos. Hold you down. And if you don't come to Jesus Christ today, you will be hurting and you will be suffering for eternity, my friend. This is our current reality.